William Bradford Reynolds has become so controversial as the Reagan administration's chief civil rights lawyer that a wide range of civil rights groups, including leading black Republicans, have called for his dismissal. So it came as a surprise to civil rights leader Jesse Jackson and Congressman John Conyers when Reynolds agreed to visit Mississippi today to investigate personally charges of violations of the Federal Voting Rights Act. During a meeting at the Justice Department last Friday, Jackson, who was considering running for the Democratic presidential nomination, complained that black voting strength is being diluted systematically by state voting practices. Chief among them is the requirement, found only in Mississippi, that voters register twice, once in their hometown and again in the county seat. Single-shot balloting requiring voters to select a slate rather than individual candidates is also under attack. The Mississippi trip is the latest in a series of moves by the Reagan administration to soften its negative image among civil rights activists. Ironically, the trip will also bolster Jackson's plans to register at least a million new black voters, mainly in the South, as part of a crusade to vote against Ronald Reagan. Kenneth Walker, ABC News, Washington.